What is going on my fellow otakus? King Market is in here. Today we're going to be talking about Jump Force. Jump Force kind of been on my mind for the past few days. Um, a lot of people keep saying that uh, Jump Force is going to be trash, stuff like that. Jump Force is not going to be a good game. And I'm here to kind of break, you know, say like, we can't judge a game until it officially comes out. That's the, I don't understand why people always got to keep saying a game is trash before the game even comes out. Now, alright. Now, now to the Boruto Shinobi Striker. Now, before I, 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 I I'm going to go off topic for a little bit. Now, that game was a little too good, but for all we know, the game might actually turn out amazing. It might not, it might not be a game for a lot of people. You know, for a lot, for one reason, it's an online only game. Online only games don't really perform that well that much anyway, so it's okay. But moving on from that, like, let's just let's start. Let's talk. Let's stick to the topic. Jump Force, right? Jump Force. We keep but anyway. We can't judge a game before it comes out. Okay, I've been like I don't understand why people always do that. People always. Excuse me, say again. Oh, this game. Oh, looks look, look at this game. This game is trash. Like the new Spider-Man game that's coming out soon. The graphics did. Mary Jane Watson. People are complaining about it, saying, "Oh my gosh, why does Mary Jane look like a granny? Why does Mary Jane look like this? Oh my gosh!" Ugh. Stop. Wait until a game comes out, and then we can judge. Just like with an like movies and anime and stuff like that. Wait till wait until that stuff comes out. Because for all we know, it may be the greatest thing you have ever put, laid your eyes upon, upon on. Like Black Clover. I'm not going to hold you. Did not like Black Clover at first. But then as more episodes started to drop, like, yo, this anime is actually pretty fire. And you know, I, people kept on saying, oh, it's, it's a similar to Naruto. No, Black Clover has its own thing going on. So I don't know why people keep saying it's just like Naruto, uh, similar to Naruto. All Anyway, I, anyway, all shonen are alike anyway. So I don't understand why people keep saying, oh, this anime is just like Naruto. Well... It's a shonen anime. Shonen anime are most likely going to be similar to each other. So I don't know why people keep saying uh, no, this and that. But Jump Force. But anyway, just like Jump Force. Any game in general. Wait until the game comes out. Then we can give our full opinions. Jump Force. I love the way it looks so far. Jump Force actually looks really, really good from a gameplay, a gameplay standpoint. It doesn't have that clunky feeling like uh, like J-Stars Victory has. The problem with J-Stars was that game. the game was like really clunky. It was very... Like slow paced, it wasn't fast paced, but Jump Force, I kind of see something new. I see something fresh, see some some brand new material, I should say, right? Um, it looks really fast paced, it looks great, it looks gorgeous from a graphic standpoint, 10 times better than J Star's Victory Plus. Um, um, my only prop, my only problem is I hope they'll add more characters. I would love to see characters like All Might, All for One, um, Ken, Ken Shino from Fist of the North Star, you and you Hakusho, you know, all the characters we saw from J Star's Victory. Hopefully they'll put them in with um, Jump Force. Hopefully they'll do that because if they don't, bro. Like, come on, we want to have a whole bunch of shonen characters. You know, we want to see Gon from uh, Hunter x Hunter. We want to see like all these shonen characters we grew up with, like JoJo the Bizarre Adventure or something like that. Or uh, who else can they throw in? They could throw in a lot, like a lot of stuff, man. I would love to see. Some of my characters in now, but love, 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 love to see that. Maybe they'll throw in some Black Clover or whatever. I would love to see Black Clover. Um, you know, just like, just crazy stuff. You know what I'm saying? Like, my Academia, I, I'll be surprised if they don't put my Academia in uh, Jump Force because my Academia is popping. It's, it's the hottest anime out to this day. Say what you want about my Academia. It is the hottest anime out right now. Um... But I love to see that and more characters. I'm good. I'm Gucci. You know what I'm saying? But we shouldn't. Let's, let's not. Let's not judge by. Let's not. Let's not judge just yet, guys. I'm telling you, like once the game comes out, it may be the best anime game we ever put our hands on. Ah, uh, Jump Force still still, still kind of has that clunkiness from like the way you look at it. Yeah, you can see the cat. The game is kind of slow pace at some parts, but it'll pick up eventually. It start. It'll start moving at a faster pace and stuff like that. But other than like J Stars or something like that. It just moves so slow and stiff and it's boring. The gameplay for me for J-Stars, it was fun, but the gameplay was just so boring. J-Stars is one of those games that you have a lot of fun playing with your friends. You can bring a friend over, you have like an anime party or whatever. I know when my friends when my friends came over and we played J-Stars Victory, plus I actually had a lot of fun playing with playing with my friends because we're, you know, I had a Brody right next to me just to play 